hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel it is hi your girl boss baby talk as you already know how you guys doing today if this is the first time i'm coming your way what we do on this platform i talk about how to migrate to canada canada job opportunity schooling apartments and i also do travel vlog okay if this sounds like what you're looking for what you search on youtube why don't you sit back relax and remember to turn on that bell notification subscribe so that you don't miss any of my upload okay and in today's video we're gonna be talking because a lot of you guys have actually come in my dm on twitter uh to ask me what about uh, uh, the conference that you know that they normally fully sponsored conference that they normally hold in Canada is there anyone like that is there anyone coming up soon in this you know you know we have just few months left for this year to be over but don't get panic you can still get in this year yeah we've got some that will be you know held in November yes guys and you can also actually go apply for you because i know a lot of you guys came in through the one that was heard last month and we actually i actually did this video which i will be adding on top of the video right here have you seen that yes you can check that through as well that is also you know they do it every year as well so this one also they normally do three in a year and this is gonna be the last one that they're gonna do in this year so how are we talking about it today if you haven't applied or if you've, you've seen it somewhere you've already applied I wish you the best of luck but if you haven't I want you to hop on it right now and go and apply without further ado let's just get right into the video we will be starting with the eventsbrights.ca and uh, for those of you like i said that i've asked in my dm on twitter you know we also hold a uh, space uh, uh you know live space on twitter last week about people asking for conferences in canada you know all the sponsor conference because a lot of people and i actually have two people that come on space that day that they came in last month you know for for the uh, for the conference that was held last month uh august so this is another one that is coming up because i know all of you guys are saying oh maybe this year is not going to be possible again or something but um you know <laughs> guys don't lose hope yet okay because there are still some this year you know that are you know that you can actually come in through okay this september ones october uh they're kind of a bit close so we look at november and how to search for this actually just go to the eventbrite.ca and you can write conferences in canada with invitation letters and whatever year you want you can also write in front of that and you can actually do your search okay because you can do this yourself as well all right so we will be talking about the gem expo visa invitation letter 2022 if you are the type that loves stone you know that love gold that love uh, you know all these gems you will also definitely like this and you can actually come in you know as a visitor you know through the gem expo okay this is really good when i saw this i was so happy like oh my people need to know about this actually so and that is why i'm bringing it to your notice guys because i know a lot of you have been waiting for these uh, opportunities so now we are here visit the gem expo in toronto canada by getting an official lawyer notarized invitation letter you can use for your travel visa application these people basically they will be giving you an invitation letter that you can actually use to apply you're gonna pay for it definitely it's around um uh, 271 20 cents okay so you're gonna be paying this to come in to be able to get the invitation letter and they also have their lawyer already they have their lawyers that work with them that can notarize that for you as well and also about the event okay you know this event is held you know uh three times in a year 
and they have already done the one for March also the one for July which also attract a lot of international people that deal with gems uh you know stones and all that they actually come in through that as a visitor some went back and some you know continue to work here because you are you know when you come in like that legally you can be here for six good months you know and you know one good thing about canada right now you can work in canada even as a visitor all you need to do is to apply for your work permit and you will be paying for that definitely and they will give it to you so you can actually work you know for that period of time before you go home and if you want to remain here you know what to do already watch our video through the next step to take when you are already here as a visitor you know and you don't want to go back you want to continue living here you want to continue you know to working in canada you take the normal step the normal route and there won't be any problem for you at all okay and the next one that is coming up is coming up november 11 till uh on the 13th of november so that means it's gonna be you know three days okay this is gonna be three days conference okay so this is really good for those visiting from overseas and require an authorized invitation letter please purchase this visa letter of invitation option to have a customized invitation letter made for you and notarized by our lawyers and this letter can be used actually to apply for your uh for your visiting uh visa uh, to into canada this is really good this is about it for me and that is why i'm talking about it guys and uh also the price includes that you're gonna get price includes three days passing three days pass you're gonna get three day pass that means you can come you know three days if you like you can come every day like you know the three times that it's gonna be held you can be there you know every time the 11 the 12 and the 13 and you know which is really really good as well once purchase please send the following information to their email is here salam at the gem expo.com okay and they're expecting you to show uh dates of show you want to attend so in case you want to attend one of them or you decide to attend three of them they want you to let them know you know which one you're going to be attending which day you're going to be attending out of the 11 12 and 13 or you want to attend three of them it's totally up to you and uh, a copy of your passport name date of birth passport number you know all that definitely should be in the in the in your passport anyways date of issue definitely should be there as well date of expire okay so if you have a business it's a plus for you so they just need a business name and the address which i always tell people if you are applying for visiting visa you need a business name yeah you need a business name because that kind of gives them the assurance like you're gonna go back to your country okay and they also need a business address you know if you don't have and you have who have that can stand in for you as your sponsor or your you know guarantor they can actually stand in for you and you know you can actually use that you know yeah they should stand in as like they're the ones sponsoring you to come you know and do that so which is really really good you know address to the career uh the notarized letter so if you choose the letter plus career option phone number if requesting career delivery obviously you're gonna need one and you will also receive a digital copy of the letter as soon as it's available select career or uh, if you need original copies okay some visa offices require original signed notarized letter for visa application check with the local office okay you could check that on google as well but uh, definitely i know always they always need it okay if you want the original signed and notarized uh paper copy 
please choose International Korea DHL, which is the best, okay? Uh, DHL Korea um, usually arrive uh, in about seven days. They, you know, that's what I say, okay? And just follow through, okay? And, you know, believe me, if you have provided all of this, the all of this information and you are truthful to yourself they wrote here please note we do not guarantee visa acceptance okay each application is different and is solely depend on the strength of your application and background check by the canadian embassy if you've actually you know be truthful about all this information you provide to them and you send to them there should not be any problem i just want you to be truthful to yourself and make sure you fill this application you know to the best of your knowledge you know just make sure you do it right there shouldn't be any problem because i don't see it as a big deal all right it's, there's nothing in it that you cannot do and all this information that they asked about already is even uh, 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 in your passports already and you know what you're gonna be including is just business name you know if they have even the letter head business of that place you can also include it anyways and um, yeah so just go ahead and apply already you know go and pay this make this payments and go and you know get your uh, travel invitation letter and you will use that to go and apply for your visiting you know uh, uh visiting visa here in canada you know coming to this place okay coming to jam as well all right i believe and i wish you the best of luck because i know you're gonna be here so i should be expecting you here soon when you get to the airport you want to dm me on twitter to pick you up as you can see here they have hosted already about 42 events in total that means they've been doing it for long because they only do three in a year and all in total they have hosted 42 that means they've been doing it for long long years okay people have been coming in they have been doing it it's not as if it's a new thing this they have been doing it so and it's been working all right i believe a lot of people have also come coming through here and they are also on facebook they are also on twitter as well so do well to check on them all right and i'll be getting into the next one for today so we are onto the next one and the last one for today okay guys and this is already uh and this is for people that are already in canada as a student or you are visiting uh, you know canada for the first time and you are still job hunting or perhaps you're still waiting on your work permit and you you know you know you come across this video this video is for you so just you know make sure you go there by december okay and uh you know definitely a job awaits you there and this uh canada job expo okay whether you are a graduate unemployed new to canada a seasoned veteran looking to change careers or even a student new to the workforce okay this is for you guys about this events you know and they have also repeat the same thing here canada job expo is great place uh, okay to begin your career paths canada job expo provides plenty of information job resources and our uh, discussion and opportunities for employment this expo is the most attended job and career event in the greater toronto area with an environment of networking learning uh, with a day of a professional interaction okay and also our past events you know these are the people they have hosted with before in the past years okay and they are also coming again this year and it's going to be held on uh, december 15th you know so do yourself well to be there 
if you are actually job hunting right now and or if you're looking for even a second job you are already working or you just want to go there and feed your eye you know you can also go there or you just want to go there for definitely networking you know education never ends okay you can also go there to learn as well okay meet some you know meet people as well on that day and these are people they've hosted with in the past okay and um, I've included a uh, major Canadian employer uh, like Apple Canada if you want to work in Apple Canada you know this is an opportunity for you to meet them on that day they're gonna be taking a whole lot of application on that day yeah you know they're gonna be taking a whole lot of application on that day on the Canada Job Expo you know December 15th so you want to be there that day if you like to work in the bank which is a uh, CIBC they're gonna be there that day Canada Bell that's the phone company they're gonna be there that day Canada Post Canada Post Office they will be there that day the Jardin is also a bank they will be there that day most head will be there that day bureaus will be there that day to run to police if you want to become a police officer you can actually do your application and you know submit you know submit it there on that day and uh toronto public service will be there okay ministry of government and services will be there so you want to be there if you want you know if even if this is what you like uh really you know looking for or you just want to just go there for an experience how oh, you don't have anywhere to go on that day you just want to go there you just want to be there okay you can go there on that day and a host of employers uh, and they are also hosting people okay uh, employers uh, uh, from Abara from uh, Manitoba from British Columbia you know as well as international organizations you know you want to be there on the, the place also join our mailing list on our home page to receive events of this okay please guys make sure you join them like they said okay you want to turn on that bell notification for them so that whenever they drop any banger like that you get it okay guys so make sure you go there okay this expo brings canadian employees so so many employers that you're gonna be meeting up there that day various organization will be there you know education institution together with skilled work and students you know for uh, a day networking so you know you can just stop by there and then uh, you know yeah you know learn and uh, employers advice you know uh they're gonna be talking a lot you go so it's gonna be like stand to stand team that you know different employer different stand that you're gonna be seeing on that day get your resume ready do like a whole lot of copies you might want to do 50 copies on that day okay and distribute to everybody like where you know you can work where do you fit in in all this job you know listed in all this employer listed on that day and you just want to be leaving it giving it to them table by table like that because there are going to be a bunch of employers there you know to meet up there so it's going to be like a fair i guess yes yeah they put it there actually so it's going to be like a job fair you know in toronto in greater toronto that day december the 15th so make sure you are there don't miss out on this you know i feel like you know already i'm feeling like you know i'm just trying to you know think about how it's gonna look like on that day you know you know fair how they do fair right so it's definitely gonna be like that you know for organization looking to register a booth with us so and they also advertising as well in a way for people you know that have their businesses and they will be looking you know for you know for people to come work for them you know they want them to also register because they say for organization looking to register a booth so they're gonna have booths like each you know each company gonna have their booth like you can go here you're tired of there you go here yeah you know i believe these people you know i like food too much i'm just thinking this food people will be there as well you know when you walk 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 you're tired you just you know stop by where you can eat something i'll take ice cream oh 
<laughs> you know, yeah, I'm just thinking of that. How oh my god, I'm thinking aloud. That's okay, anyways. You already know I love food, guys. So, yeah, I also want them to register. Please contact us for further details. Cause registration process and etc. Okay, so that is it, guys. That's all about it for today. So, be there on that day. This, it's not possible for you not to get a job like with these people you know imagine applying to 50 places 50 places 50 different company 20 different company there's no how you cannot get a job so and this is like a job fair which you can actually make sure your resume you do a whole lot of copy bunch of copies that day and just be giving them boots by boots okay give it to them and before you know it you're gonna come and thank me later all right you can also dm me on my twitter if you have any question you want to ask me yes guys we've actually come to the end of today's video yeah if you haven't applied already guys please go ahead and apply and for those of you that have watched this video through and also watch my ad i say a very big thank you to you and i love you guys you already know that if you haven't subscribed go ahead and subscribe so that you don't miss any of my upload also you can also share this video for me on your twitter on your facebook on your ig on your whatsapp status please always share this video so that it will get to the right people that actually need this video okay guys until i come your way again i remain your girl boss baby talk you know i love you